Earlier this week Mario Batali stepped down from his restaurant empire and left the Chew after multiple women accused him of UAL misconduct going back two decades. On Friday night, Batali issued an apology for what he called his past behavior, and he shocked everybody by inexplicably including a recipe for cinnamon rolls. Batali sent the apology in his email newsletter. As many of you know, this week there has been some news coverage about some of my past behavior, he wrote. I have made many mistakes and I am so very sorry that I have disappointed my friends, my family, my fans and my team. My behavior was wrong and there are no excuses. I take responsibility. Sharing the joys of Italian food, tradition and hospitality with all of you, each week, is an honor and privilege. Without the support of all of you my fans I would never have a forum in which to expound on this. Batali signed off, writing I will work every day to regain your respect and trust, MB but then, for reasons he does not explain, Batali added a postscript to his apology for UAL misconduct to pitch a recipe for cinnamon rolls. P.S. In case you're searching for a holiday-inspired breakfast, these pizza dough cinnamon rolls are a fan favorite, he added. The internet's reaction was swift and furious. Many people found the cinnamon roll apology tone deaf, insincere, and among the worst apologies in recent memory. Https twitter.com shed food blogger status 9418068719372738628 hoots twitter.com the gurgle link hod status 9418319306805493766 hits twitter.com jewels underscores a status 9418293177298206727 hits twitter.com pete underscore well status 9418619430145105920 others pointed out that Batali had apologized to his friends, family, fans, and team, but he did not actually apologize to his alleged victims, or mention them at all. HTTPS Twitter.com Curly Comedy Status 9418206862841111872 According to Business Insider, Walmart and Target say they're cutting ties with Batali since the allegations came forth, and Italy has taken all Batali's books and products off its shelves. View slideshow more on Harrisman.